morning, Krusty crew, and welcome to another episode of the Good Morning Commute. I'm Bethany. And I'm I called them the Krusty Crew. Talk about like from funny, SpongeBob. It's from SpongeBob. Oh, okay, let's talk about that. Oh, and I was talking over one of our topics about um, it's how to make a thank you card. How to, how to make a thank you card. Thank you card. Krusty Crew. Krusty Crew. I love the word crusty. Isn't it just funny? It is pretty funny. Crusty. When the band's been Diabetes. Oh, there's diabetes. See, that's our cue. That's our cue. Hi, hey guys. guys. How's it going? Uh, well, I'm doing great. I'm doing really good. Um, and I just really, really hope that all our listeners are having a good day and a good time. I know it's just the beginning of the day. You know, it's 8.30 in the morning. You're uh, still probably waking up. Or maybe you've been awake for a hot minute and you are in full swing of your morning. Uh, but regardless of where you're at this morning, thank you for tuning into the Good Morning Commute. We're lucky to have you. We are so lucky to have you. Maybe you just got done with your night shift at um, Taco, at Bell. Taco Bell and you're headed home to take a nap to finish out the rest of this day. But you know what? Wherever you are, we're glad you're here. I'm glad you're here, and I'm also glad that it's the National Day of Prayer. Oh, wow. That's Wait, really good. I feel like that should be, like, a bigger deal. Like, we yeah. should know, like, that's not just a funny, silly calendar holiday. Like, the National Day of Prayer, that should be yeah, actually that's, something celebrated. That's really good. Let's celebrate that and pray extra today. You want to pray right now, Emma? Sure. Okay. Dear God, thank you so much for today. Thank you for this Thursday. And thank you for my friend Emma. And thank you for uh, all of our listeners out there. I hope uh, they just have a really great day, Lord. And that uh, you give them many blessings, as you always do, Lord. Amen. Amen. Wow. Amen. Thank you. That, thanks for praying for us. Dude, I've heard uh, like a sermon before. That is, It was just like, you know, you should always be in like constant prayer like just oh, right thanks god for that guy opening the door for me thanks god for uh me getting to shoot yeah. the gap with my car oh yeah that lane wow successfully okay. i don't like just like constantly thinking god or oh god yeah. please help me with this math test you know just like in constant prayer you know agreed what a awesome way to incorporate your lord and savior into your life amen all day prayer. long it shouldn't just be when you're eating or before you go to bed you know P pray exactly. con continuously continuously so um keep that in mind today and always and always it's also the national day of reason <sighs> tis the season to be jolly, fa la 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 la. It's the reason for the season. <sighs> that's that's Easter. They say that around Easter, right? It's the uh, reason for the season. He's the reason for the season. Is that what they say? They say that for Christmas, I think. I oh, don't know. Oh my goodness, you're so right. I don't know. Man. But, I mean, like, um, reason. A day of reason? Like a it's like, day of hey, thought? Hey, listen to reason. Shh. Use Shh. your brain. Shh. I'm listening to reason. It's reason. Yeah. Did you hear it? I heard it. Me too. <laughs> it was the day of reason. It's also National Life Insurance Day. Yeah, so if you don't have life insurance, you better get some. You better get some. I mean, oh, buddy. Oh, buddy. It's it's the National Life Insurance Day. Um, Golly, you never know what's going to happen. We've had so many thunderstorms lately. <gasps> there was yeah, a tornado, tornado watch. Tornado, yeah. What was that, Tuesday? Uh, I don't I don't know. That's actually why we didn't have a show yesterday. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, t t tornado watches, we were in a basement. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So, um, yeah, it's time to get that life insurance. You never know what's going to happen. You never know. It's also uh, truffle day. The, mm. the kind of truffle that you eat. Like the chocolate ones. Yeah, the yummy ones. The cakey ones. ones. Love a good truffle. I feel like a truffle is kind of like a cake ball without a stick. Tell me I'm wrong. Um, I definitely agree. I think I agree. Well, wait. I don't know if they have cake in them. Oh, dang. It's like coated in chocolate, icing, it's cocoa like a powder. Ganache. 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 Uh, there's nuts sometimes. There's coconut. Nugget. Uh, nugget. Nugget. <laughs> nugget. <laughs> nugget. <laughs> <laughs> Fruit, Shall fudge, coffee, mint, marshmallow, 
You name it. You name it. You yeah, name anything. It. Marshmallow. Uh-oh. Anything marshmallow. So time to get out there today and eat a truffle. It's also National World Pass... I mean, sorry, not National. It's World Password Day. Oh, well, gosh. Hey, we just changed our password here in the we station did, for our yeah. computers. Mm-hmm. Um, it's... No, 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 no. One, Uh-oh. two, three. Bro, I thought you were going to say our new the password. Real yeah, the real one. Um... I was actually in charge of changing the password this time. I had the lucky opportunity, and I don't know why. She was going to make it funny. I don't know why I didn't make it butts123. That would have been so much funnier than what the password actually is. Yeah. I tried to be sophisticated or whatever. So I think today's the day to share with your neighbors who... All your passwords. Your your passwords. (laughs) (laughs) Yep. I'm just kidding. It's funny. I was talking to our supervisor, Laramie, about passwords, and he was like... I never give anyone my PIN number or my social security number. Or my, and I was like, yeah, no. you know, that's really smart. But I actually know, like, my parents' PIN number. I know my sister's social security number. And I've told a couple people mine as well. <gasps> about, Why would like, you trusted do that? people, friends, and stuff like oh, that. Oh, okay, good. Friends that hopefully will not steal my identity or all my money, you know? Probably not. I hope not. Probably not. Emma, do you want to know my PIN number? Sure, we can talk about it later. <gasps> Wait, do you think they heard that? Okay, I just whispered it, but... I don't think they heard okay, it. Well, it was okay, you'll me. never find me. No, you'll, you'll never, never find, find me, guys. No. You'll never do you find want to know why? Yeah. <laughs> what, uh, does that mean anything? Nope. All right, I like it. <laughs> Thank you. I like it. Dope. Okay, well, now that we know each other's PIN numbers, <laughs> I think we are successfully celebrating World Password Day. That's right, Exactly. All right, well, let's get into today's topic. Yeah, so we're talking about um, how to make a thank you card, how to make a personalized thank you card, that is. So mm-hmm. we're rolling around uh, graduation time. Mm-hmm. Uh, people are making babies, having them. Uh, so we need to uh, figure out how to make thank you cards because people are going to start sending you gifts. Um, and, you know, you're going to have to thank people. So Yeah, I mean, yeah. why buy thank you cards when you can make them? That is so true. Yeah. That is true. So we're going to tell you how to do it. Um, Very extra. Like, there's a lot really? of really detailed stuff. So get your pen and paper out. So uh, the first step is Oh, WikiHow. To... Oh, yeah, it's from WikiHow, of yeah. course. You know yeah. us. Uh-huh. The boys at WikiHow say to choose a design. And that's the yeah. first category. Mm-hmm. And the first tip for choosing a design is to form a pretty border on your card using washi tape. Oh, I Am love I washi right? tape. Yeah, washi? I use washi tape. Really? It's really fun. Yeah. What's it like? It's just tape. That's like it's like a soft tape, and you can stick it to stuff. Okay, and like it, it's colorful. It's for scrapbooking and stuff like that. Okay, it, it's got patterns. It says colors, um, glitter sometimes. Beautiful. Okay. There's so. all kinds of assortments, so you can make your your thank you card look however you want. Yeah. I mean, that's that's definitely an idea. Um, you could also create a collage of magazine cutouts um, to Ugh. make unique designs. Um, that's funny. So, they have the word thanks in magazine cutouts. Letters, yeah. Letters, so like, a like a serial killer. Note. That's weird. Give I don't know if I would make money. it. Yeah, I don't know if I would make it look like or a serial killer. Or the dog gets it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Also, thank you. <laughs> and, and thank you. Wow, that's good. Well, yeah. I feel like that's cute, though. It's, it could be cute. Maybe. Like, the one that they're making looks kind of cute. It looks like somebody is holding your dog captive. Yeah, but they put pictures of food on it, so that's weird. That's really strange. <laughs> Give us the money or we'll eat your food. So, there's an idea. You could take, like, a Dove uh, advertisement and put cut out a piece of soap. Mm-hmm. Put it on there, make it really pretty. Mm-hmm. That's good. That's a good idea. Thanks. I guess. Um, moving on. Next tip is to design a colorful balloon or a rainbow card for a young child. Oh, oh wow. Option. So you could cut out pieces of paper, shape of a balloon. Um, Draw a rainbow for yeah, little Timmy. Little Tim Tim. Yeah, this is pretty cute. It really is, and uh, your son or daughter or neighbor or whatever, your young child, is really going to like it. Yeah. Balloons and rainbows are all the rage these all days. All the galore. You could also cut out shapes to adorn the front of the card with pretty designs. Oh, I love that word. Adorn. Adorn. Wow. 
So yeah, you can cut out an Illuminati.